Are you encountering too many missed calls? This can be really frustrating. If you are facing this problem, here are some simple solutions to fix this issue. Okay, so the first thing you can do is try rebooting the phone. Rebooting your device is the most common cure that can work anytime in almost any scenario. So try restarting your device to see if the issue has resolved. If restarting the device didn't work, you need to check the ring volume of your Android device and see if it is muted or normal. There are four categories under sound settings in Android devices, media volume, call volume, ring volume, and alarm volume. So if you are using the volume buttons to change the volume, make sure it is the ring volume that you are changing. To check if the ring volume is enabled, go to settings and then go to sound or sound and vibration. Now check the slider for ring volume and make sure it is above the minimum level and it is not set to minimum. Just drag the slider next to the ring volume to change it and see if that fixes the issue. Now, the next scenario is if your phone's ring volume is affected by the DND mode. If your Android device is switching to the silent mode automatically, then it might be possible that the DND, or Do Not Disturb mode, could be the issue here. Open settings on your Android device and scroll down to Sound and Vibration. Then tap on it, and in the following menu, tap on Do Not Disturb. This step might be different across various Android devices, you need to look for a setting named Schedules. Make sure that no automatic rule or schedule is active. If it is active, just turn it off. It might be possible that any recent app that you might have installed or updated is tinkering with the sound control options. Apps have different permissions, which can also let them modify the volume of the device. In such a scenario, you need to uninstall any new apps one by one and see if the issue is fixed. Finally, if all else fails to fix the problem, then you can try using some third-party apps such as Volume Control to set a default volume. Also, you can use presets and define volume for different apps and prioritize them accordingly. That's all for now. If you like this guide, make sure to follow and subscribe to Guiding Tech for more tutorials for your iPhone and other tech products. And make sure to check out one of these videos we think you might enjoy.